Uh, Mondelez, first of all, we uh, identify snacking as more of a behavior. So it's anything that happens instead of a meal or in between a meal. And we believe that the snacking market's over $146 billion. It's actually growing at a three-year CAGR of over 4%. It uh, tends to outpace most of food and beverage. And the average snacker snacks over three times a day. So uh, it's actually becoming how we eat. So what we look at is we've identified nine moments, which basically takes a, an, an occasion, a need state of a consumer, and that consumer and brings it all together. And that's how we identify some of these occasions. So for example, uh, a meal skipper would be one of our moments. And as you know, many people are rushed and they tend to skip meals. So we have found that breakfast is an occasion that most consumers skip. So we've come out with products like Belvita, which meets that need. It's a nutritious way, it's a great option, it's portable, um, and it provides four hours of sustained energy. Another example is del delightful variety, where consumers are sneak, uh, seeking a snacking option uh, that's different than they've ever had. And what we've done to meet that need is a red velvet Oreo, where we actually change the base cake to be red velvet and change the inside cream to be more of a cream cheese uh, flavor. So we've delivered truly on that indulgent red velvet taste, uh, bringing Oreo to a different usage. The magic of snacking is it's, it's very impulsive. So 45% of snacking occasions are actually unplanned. So it's critically important uh, at retail to really have that snacking category represented uh, you know, merchandise the appropriate way because snacker uh, consumers will buy it impulsively, but then it will actually generate more usage. So they buy it, they bring it home, they eat it more, and then they actually increase their purchase cycle. We play a critical role in helping consumers, uh, empowering them to really snack more mindfully. Uh, in fact, we made a commitment by 2020 that we're going to increase our better choices by 25%. We're going to reduce our sodium and saturated fats by 10%. We're going to provide 25% more options on portion control, and we're going to increase our whole grains by 25%. So portability has become essential for snacking. In fact, 60% of consumers cite portability as one of the most important factors in buying a snack. So we've used this insight to create one of our moments which is easier on the go. And from that, we've actually expanded our pack types to meet that need. So a great example is King Size, where we have uh, a lot of varieties like Oreos and Chips Ahoy that offer a consumer a portable option with many of our great brands um, that meets that on-the-go need.